Good to me? Yes, sir. We had Reggie Stadium, uh, field, where a lot of activities has been going on. I am Sir from L. This is Ina View TV, and I'm here with Miss Adelma. Uh, Mr. Adelma, how are you? I'm good, thank you. All right. Uh, what you represent within the sports aspect? Well, I'm a member of Rajas Stadium Physical Cultural Sporting Club, and I represent um, female football in Belize. Okay. We have um, three U13 teams currently formulating a U10 team and a U15 team. All right. And how long you been doing this? Well, I literally have been playing football for like over two decades, and then I went into coaching aspect of it. And that has been um, one, two, three. that has been about four years now. Okay, you you was playing on the, you was playing on a team before. Yes, the team called Millennium. When the Millennium came in, we formulated this team called Millennium. So uh, it has been from two thousand. All right. So you you was playing what uh, football or football? All right. So I was playing football, right? Footballer. Mm -hmm. All right. Primarily then, defense. All right. Yeah. So they, I see they had the activities Saturday and Sunday. What was that all about? Well, we decided to um, formulate um, some games and activities. We had um, football activities and we had basketball activities. Okay. And we had volleyball activities. There were activities throughout the sporting arena. All right. And um, basically I was um, dealing with female football. So oh. we field a U13 team. All right, the, and the, the youth, but they was 13? Yeah, they were under 13. Un, under 13, how right. did that go? Actually, it went pretty well. We didn't win, we lost 1 nil, but um, it went perfect. Right. That was Saturday? Yes, that was Saturday. Okay, seems like, like you enjoy what you do. Oh, yes, I do. Yeah, mm. yeah. I don't see myself any other place but on the pitch coaching, if not coaching, playing. All right. right. Well, it's good to know that we have people that represent uh, our country, we're in Belize City, Central America, mm -hmm. at uh, Roger Stadium. This is in um, Belize City, as I say, and um, we're here representing and contributing and let the youth know that people care. That's right. Right, and we're giving back to the youth. So um, we had a whole lot of youths. How, mu how much youth you normally work with? Well, various 300, uh, 200. No, oh, basically it'll be um, it's under a hundred because it's um, literally like about sixteen to twenty players on a team. All right. And with the three teams we have together, we pull like literally close to um, approximately fifty to sixty players on those three teams. All right. So then this program is for the summer only. No, it's an ongoing program, All and right. actually I'm looking at a long-term program where. Because um, not only necessarily that we do the Mondolito, but we also do um, primary school teams. Okay. Right? And then they have primary school competitions. And I'm looking at a five-year plan, basically. All right. All right. All right. Sounds good. Great. I'll give thanks for this interview. And uh, uh, I bless you and wish you best success and continue doing what you do. I know you love what you do. Yes, I do. Yeah. And I would like to invite some other young people, if you are interested in playing football, Please come over to Rogers Stadium and you can sign up or sometimes you can meet me out at Berger Field and the time to do that would be like around 3, 3.30 and it lasts up until I am there until about 5 o'clock. Okay. But um, sports is definitely an activity you'd want to engage in. It keeps you from being idle. It um, gives you a discipline, so to speak, and it helps to um, shape your life. All right. Well, give thanks again. Blessings. Bless.